The 2018 All-American Qualifiers are presented by Bodacious Dash, a graded steak sire combining the brilliance of First Down Dash and Mr. Jess Perry. And by Granada Farms, also standing down in Dash and EC Jet One. Fourth fastest, day two, No Mires a la Luna. Blue Collar Gelding No Mires a la Luna worked hard all summer to earn $50,000 in New Mexico bred steaks. His trainer, Trey Ellis, thought the son of First Moon Flash deserved a shot at the spotlight. Well, I mean, he showed the talent. He's a big, big gelding, and, you know, he looks like a 440 horse all summer. And, I mean, I'd look forward all summer, you know, for the All-American. And, you know, we tried him in the New Mexico bred races, and he run good. Uh, you know, both finals, he got in a little trouble out the gates. But, I mean, he showed his class and you know, in the 440 races. They're running off just a step slow with Nomira Zala Luna trying to come on now. And at the rail, it's Asteroid Dash. And in the center of the course, Bad Habit Jess. And here he is on Nomira Zala Luna. And Kiss My Eagles going with them. And in the grandstand side, CD's Wine and Dine. Bad Habit Jess. Nomira Zala Luna outside CD's Wine and Dine. Bad Habit Jess. Nomira Zala Luna. Breeder and co owner Byron Woodard partners with David Valdez, who finished second in this race in 2014. Nomitas a la Luna salvaged what had been a frustrating All-American experience for trainer Trey Ellis. We ended up on Friday the, I mean, the sixth fastest time, just to tick off from, from getting in. And I mean, that was a long two days and the last trial and, you know, he, he pulled through and it was, you know, it was real nerve wracking waiting on that time to pop up, you know, and then, you know, we got in. Nomitas a la Luna translates to don't look at the moon. Fortunately, the All-American will be run in broad daylight. Watch the All-American Finals September 2nd and 3rd live on Rye TV.